Hey everyone, Fergie Fresh back again with another episode of Hotline Miami. This is episode number five, and uh, I kind of uh, jumped, I guess, the gun in the last episode, and uh, I cut myself off before you got to see that I unlocked a new mask and some other fun stuff. So, I'm going to grab a drink of water, and we're going to kick this pig in the, uh, in the stomach. I apologize to any vegan audience members or vegetarian audience members that I may have. However, that is a saying that I have grown familiar with, so let's look at our new mask. Ted! Ted is creepy. We also unlocked a beer can! Alright. Let's see what we got going on in here. Ah, oh, this is my little interlude between levels. Welcome back, sir. How are you tonight? You don't look so happy. To be honest, I don't feel too good either. Something in the air. I don't know. I just have this really bad feeling like something terrible has happened tonight. I haven't felt this way since San Francisco. I don't like it. Not one bit. So how about a drink? It's on me. Awesome. Let's take our drink. And of course, we're going to go ahead and go drive. I like how I didn't say thank you or anything to that guy. And, man, I'm, I'm looking at the, the dimensions that I have set up for recording, because this, this game doesn't really lend itself to a full-screen recorder. And, uh, yeah, ooh, the three shadowy figures. And I see that I'm set up outside of the actual bounds of gameplay here. So, you came back. How are you feeling? You look ill. Maybe you should see a doctor. I told you not to come back here. I see that my opinion of you doesn't matter. If you insist on returning here, then I should leave. Have you thought about what I asked you last time? I'm not here to give you any answers. Questions are all I have to offer a man like you. If you're not feeling well, maybe you should rest. Some things don't work out best when you don't try so hard. Some things work out best when you don't try so hard. No matter who you are, bearing too much weight inevitably leads to the collapse of everything. Next time we meet, we'll be the last. I can see it in your eyes. Before you go, I'll leave you with these three predictions. Someone who, someone you know is not who you think he is. Something will soon be taken from you. On July 21st, you will wake up in a bigger house. That is all. Okay, so I've got, what, almost two months until I get a bigger house? What's that, baby? How you is? Did I sleep in this last night? Are we sleeping in different beds? Like, I saved you, and you still make me sleep in the... You know what? Get out. Hey, it's Pat from the club. We want you to DJ tonight. You're free to play any kind of music you want. Beer is on the house. We're on 212 Northeast 24th Street. Dress to kill. See ya. Ellipsis click. This feels upbeat. I wonder if I'm actually going to go DJ something, or if I'm, uh... Yeah. I'm going to have to fix these, these dimensions in, in post. Because, I don't know, this game just decides to change itself consistently. Eighth chapter. Push it. And, of course, we're going to be doing Fist of Fury. That is the most most useful one of these I've had. There we go. And we'll grab a gun. And that's lined with glass. What's up, puppy? Suck it, puppy. And you two can die. What do we got down here? Okay, still lined with glass. Um, okay. Note to self. Take out the front man first. Alright. wonder if I can get to you. Yep, I can. And there's my puppy. So... Take that, doggy. Not good. Okay. Got that guy. And I'm out of ammo. Nah. When all else fails, throw the gun. There's that. And who else do I got left in this establishment here? Okay, I got one guy on the left, and I can't get to him through here. Can I get to him through here? Oh, he is so getting samurai Yep, just like that. 
And we're taking a samurai sword to the next level because you can't really beat a samurai sword. This thing's just... Oh, I so had him. Whatever. We're going to try that again. Yep. Welcome to my sword. Whoa. Okay. That actually, like, I actually shook. I don't know if you could hear it on the controller, but that scared the crap out of me. Oh, I thought I had the drop on him. All right. Okay. I'm going to take out this whole level using the samurai sword. Like, that's it. That's what's going to happen here. That. What? What? Where did you even come from? Did he just, like, stand back up? All right. Hello. Ooh, that buried pretty deep in your brain housing group. Oh, I took like five swings at you. You should have been dead. All right. This again. Stab to the brain piece. Let's go take out this guy. There's that. All right, now we already learned... We'll just take that guy out like that. Stab you. Jam that into your skull. Oh, the dogs don't get hit by the doors. Come on. All right. Oh, he was too close. Man, okay. I'm sorry. I'm trying to concentrate. This level's actually taking some of my... No. All of my cunning. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Excuse me there, sir. Your brain needs to breathe some air. Alright. One down. Stabby, stabby. All right, what do we got down here? What? I tried throwing the sword at him and it didn't work. I would think that throwing a sword at somebody would be a pretty severe detriment to their health. Alright, where am I supposed to go now? Am I supposed to... is that like it? Am I done? Okay, well, we'll just go this way then. Yep, I think we're done. That's not any fun. There was like hardly any level to that level. Okay, so we're not done because I can't go back out to the car. There we go. All right, sweet. So there is some level to this level. Okay, they were definitely ready for me. I'm getting some pretty severe uh, frame drop on this. Take that. Okay, well, he was more than ready for me. Man, why is this level so framey? go. Anybody else around here want a piece? Okay, that guy. <coughs> okay. Well, I hit him with the sword. Man, this is really framey. Yep, there's that. Hmm. Bet I can get him. Yep, I got him. Alright, who's paying attention in this room? Alright, there's two of you there, so... We're going to go ahead and swap over. Oh, come on. I double tapped him. Oh, you're not supposed to have a gun. You're supposed to have a pipe. Like that. That's how you kill me. 
There, we'll just plan ahead for you to have a gun, jerk. <laughs> Alright, so this level is going to take uh, not a small amount of figuring some stuff out. Okay, there's that. Now this guy... Yes, yes. Come investigate your sliced up friend. Got you two. And take that. Somewhere around here there's a gun. There it is. Chapter clear. All right. Let's get the hell out of here. So, I still haven't figured out why or how or what caused me to attack the dude wearing the motorcycle helmet. I don't know who he was. Um, the game hasn't really alluded to anything about it. But I definitely want to know why I killed that guy and why he went on a... I'm, I'm guessing he went on a killing spree in that building before I got there. Like, I think that was the problem. New weapon unlocked. Level, push it. Time, 182 seconds. Grade, B minus. New mask, Rufus. New weapon, the Scorpion. Um, I didn't do that. Hey man, gotta tell you something important. This, all of this is not really happening. Take a look. You don't believe, you don't look like you believe me. Then allow me to demonstrate. Okay. There was a body right there. Hey man, nice to see you. Friendly faces are few and far between these days. Just take what you want. My treat. Have a good night, man. See ya. Okay. Can I just get in my car? I don't want to take anything. I just want to leave. May 31st. Alright. Well, I don't know how long I've been recording this, but that level took some time. So I'm going to go ahead and say that's a wrap for Episode 5 of Fergie Fresh Plays Hotline Miami. And uh, come back and we'll, uh, we'll see who's on this phone call message here. This phone message. This voicemail. The thingy on my desk right there. We'll find out who that is. I'm Fergie Fresh. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and click like. If you really like what you saw and you want to see some more of it, click subscribe. Maybe even tell a friend about it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.